This is a day in my life at Harvard. The trees are in full bloom now. So the yard looks really nice. I'm walking to Jefferson Lab right now. That's the physics building. There's a lot going on today. There's an award ceremony for the grad students. They did some good work. After the celebration, I headed to the Science Center with my research group. This talk is a really big deal. These scientists took a picture of a black hole at the center of the Milky Way. This is the second picture of a black hole ever taken. This talk got my group thinking about black holes. For the last few weeks, we've been developing a theory related to chaos. We just finished the framework for the theory. Now we just have to find an application for it. But finding one has been tricky. But after listening to this talk, we think our theory can be applied to black holes. There's a very famous problem called the hayden Prescott thought experiment. Basically, if you throw something into a black hole, you can teleport it out. You can do this by collecting the light that's radiating away from the black hole. So now, we're using our theory to give a new perspective on why you're allowed to do this. And after a little bit of effort, we were actually able to show that our theory can explain something about this problem. I've been thinking about this black hole problem for a pretty long time. Since I started grad school, actually. It took almost three years to figure out something new about it. So making this connection felt good. But I always remind myself to be careful. Whenever I have a small victory, I think of something that Conor McGregor said. He said people can get comfortable with a win and slack off. I don't want that to be me. So when you find some success, you move on. And you find the next problem. Because struggling through a new problem is a lot more fun than staring at a solved problem. So move forward. <laughs>